What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. I'm Chris, this is 4K Motoring, and today we've got another Nissan Titan video. Based on what I've seen, a lot of feedback on online, on the Titan forums, the Nissan Titan tailgate bushing. Now this product works for the Titan XD and the regular Titan, I believe also for the first generation Titan. So from 2004 onward, this part should work for you. So let's go ahead and take a look at the product. We're gonna see how to install it and hopefully see whether or not it is worth the money. Now this product was sent over by Accessory Anchor. If you guys have seen some of the posts on the Nissan Titan forums, if you guys are on there, it is an aluminum tailgate bushing. Now Nissan Titan was the first truck on the market to have one of these dampened tailgates and now it seems like it's caught on and just about everyone has one. So behind this tailgate here, behind the section of the bumper, there's actually a gas strut that connects to basically a, an arm right here. And that arm has a bushing that connects to the tailgate. That bushing is made out of plastic and often cracks on these trucks causing problems with a dampened tailgate. So this product is basically replacing that with aluminum. So hopefully your service life is a whole lot longer. Obviously this is a pickup truck. The tailgate is meant to come off. So we're going to talk about that first. We're going to remove the tailgate and we're going to go ahead and replace this bushing. All right, first we're going to go ahead and look at this cord right here. Obviously this is to keep the tailgate stable when you have weight on it so it doesn't flex out. We're going to go ahead and hold the tailgate up at about a 45 degree angle, flex this out over this bolt and go ahead and slide this up and forward. This should remove the tailgate support here. It's going to be our first step once we remove both of these to get this tailgate off. You guys can see on the driver's side, right here on the back of the hinge, it basically is a C channel. It kind of goes like this around it. So in normal operation, the hinge is covered, but at a certain angle, you can just literally lift this off of the hinge itself. It is open. So at the right angle, this will pull off and your whole tailgate will just pull out. It is aluminum, shouldn't be too heavy, hopefully. If you have the electronic tailgate, there is a little tab you can pull right there and that will allow you to free your latch plug. So now with the tailgate disconnected, we're gonna hold it up at an angle right about here, lift the left side off and then pull. This is the side we're gonna be replacing. Well, it's not an exact replica. We did have to saw this one basically in half to get it off. It had some sort of adhesive and it wasn't just pulling off. But this is the factory one that came out. It is definitely plastic. You notice how it has this little tab to kind of hit some stoppers. It is plastic, so I don't imagine it's doing anything. There's the inside of it. Again, had to use the Dremel to cut it in half basically to get it off. This is the replacement. It is all aluminum, so metal, not plastic. It's gonna have the same interior dimension, so it'll fit right on the factory kind of mount. And except for that little tab that, it, again, this is plastic, so I don't think it's doing anything. It's gonna be a direct slip-on replacement. We're gonna go ahead, find our little nub here, slide it on, and that is our replacement. That will then slot directly into this tailgate. When we put it back together, we'll put our tailgate back on that side, get our wires connected, and this installation is done. It is that easy. All right, our tailgate is in, our bushing is mounted, everything is in position. We're gonna make sure our cables get connected. And with that, we are complete. We have our cables connected. 
we have our tailgate plug back in place. Both sides are complete and our accessory anchor is doing the job. Just like before, one finger can lift up the tailgate, can let it slowly drop. Just like that. And everything seems to be working. Now, if you guys are interested in these tailgate graphics, I have the reflective silver on the back, just in case the tailgate's down, it gives me a little bit extra visibility. Aaron Walls with Graphics 615. I'll leave a link to them down below. They make some awesome Titan products to include the reflective side panels and the front embossed letters. Again, these are reflective black. So guys, that is the installation for the Nissan Titan accessory anchor, all aluminum tailgate bushing, CNC machined. Perfect fit for the Nissan Titan. The hardest part of this job is getting the old one off. If yours is already cracked, which a lot of these are, he said he's already sold 2000 of these. So obviously this is a big issue for these trucks. It'll probably come right off. It may be just disintegrated in the truck already. If yours is still in good condition, my truck has about 50,000 miles on it. Hasn't been used for real heavy work, but the tailgate comes up and down a lot and my plastic bushing was still okay. I did have to use a Dremel basically to cut it in half to get it off. Everything else went flawless. The tailgate's really easy to remove and not too bad to put back either. The whole thing can be done in literally just a few minutes. Obviously, I'm a big fan of anything for these Nissan Titans that makes them stronger and better. A lot of these things have been sold. There have been a lot of failures and this is just cheap insurance to strengthen your truck. If you guys have any other products that you'd like to see or you know of any other products that make these trucks stronger, different aftermarket stuff that really makes them work better, let me know in the comments below. If you guys have had issues with your tailgate bushings, let me know how you knew that there was an issue and I'd love to know how many of you have actually had these issues. Like I said, I'm gonna leave a link to this in the description below as well as to the Graphics 615 for the Nissan Titan decals if you guys are interested. Otherwise, Make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel for more Nissan Titan content. If there's anything specifically you want to see, let us know. We'll be back soon.